Here are all the parts for your Victoria Model 250 food strainer as they come right out of the box. You should find a body and shaft, spring, spiral, screen and gasket, waste spout, squirt guard, hopper, handle, plunger, and instruction manual. To assemble your Victoria 250 food strainer, first loosen the clamp on the body. Clamp the food strainer body to a table or counter, making sure to press it forward on the counter all the way. Using only your hands, tighten the clamp to secure the body. Installed inside the body is a shaft. Remove the shaft and apply a drop of cooking oil on the seal using your finger. When you're finished, insert the shaft back into the body until the C-clip is touching the inner wall of the body. Next, place the screen on the shaft. It doesn't matter which end goes first. Inside the screen is the gasket. To check that it has been installed properly, remove the gasket. The gasket may be smooth on both sides or have ridges on one side. If the gasket has ridges, place the gasket back in the screen, making sure the ridges are facing inside the screen. Improper placement may damage the gasket, so be sure it is secure and flush with the screen. Take the spiral and place it into the screen small end first. Place the spiral and the screen onto the body. You may need to rotate it back and forth to make sure the shaft fits onto the spiral. Make sure the arrows on the body and the screen are aligned. Using both hands if you need to, push and twist the spiral to the right until the bolt on the screen has passed the tab on the body. Tighten the bolt to secure the screen, hand tight only. Place the waste spout on the end of the screen making sure all the clips on the spout are in place over the lip of the screen. It may take a little coaxing to get it on all the way. Take the squirt guard and place it over the screen. Standing behind the strainer, place the squirt guard over the screen from the right hand side. The larger end goes on the larger side of the screen. Here's how not to install the squirt guard. The lip of the guard must go over the collar of the screen or the guard will come off. Make sure both sides snap on over the screen and the waste spout. Place the hopper, small side down, into the orifice on the top of the body. Insert the handle into the shaft on the body of the strainer. Place the plunger into the hopper for safekeeping until you're ready to start the food straining process. And you're set! Please review the manual for instructions on the use, care, and cleaning of your Victoria strainer. Enjoy!